lifting up 11 people here in uh, the D Detroit metro area. This is just one of the indictments being handed down against those 11 people. They are part of a $35 million scheme to defraud money from Medicaid. Now, some of these people are legitimate health care providers. Others are paid recruiters, paid to go out and solicit people who have Medicaid numbers. And today, patients, legitimate patients, are being warned to guard their Medicaid numbers. That these defendants and others like them will use Medicare beneficiaries as pawns for profit if allowed to do so. Medicare beneficiaries should guard their Medicare numbers carefully. They should be treated like credit cards. Accepting a payment in exchange for allowing someone to use your Medicare number to bill for services not rendered or for medically unnecessary services is illegal. As our nation struggles to deal with how we're going to address health care, uh, providing health care to our citizens, the very least we can do is make sure people aren't stealing from the health care system. And uh, some of those people here in Metro Detroit will be arraigned in federal court this afternoon. Reporting live downtown, I'm Val Clark, Channel 7 Action News. Okay.